Hey everyone, welcome back to my latest trapping video. Today I'll be showcasing some traps on my 200 mil solo trap. This was my free to play trap by the way, so there's gonna be a ton of clips from it. Also, if you guys have noticed, I haven't had any clips in the last couple days. That's because I was on vacation. I will show you a clip right here. Both go down. Yeah. There you go. Anyways, we are back, but yeah, if you guys want to see more of those clips, let me know. I will be showcasing maybe some and like peppering them in the video. If you want to see more, let me know in the comments down below. Anyway, so let's get into the video today. Um, actually, before we get into the video today, I want to tell you guys about the giveaway, the 560 million might giveaway I am doing. Again, there will be more, uh, what's called those uh, clips or not clips, uh, codes within this video and the videos this week. I will do the stream this Friday, so don't miss it. Again, uh, you have about 24 hours to contact me or once I contact you. And during that one, I will be picking 10 people. So um, because I told you guys not to put the codes in the comments, just the number of codes, uh, when I talk, when I contact you, make sure you have the codes available. So when I contact you, you can tell me the codes. So, um, because I will pick 10 people. Um, the first person I pick will be the first person I contact. If, they, if I contact them and they don't have the codes, I will go down the list of two, three, four, five. And eventually I'll get the someone who actually has all the codes and that person will win but during the stream I'll be picking 10 names so maybe you are one of those lucky 10 people again if you're picked first you have the first chance to win but if you don't have all the codes you won't win so that's pretty simple again I will be uh, filtering it to the number of codes in that my last video will go live on Thursday I think um, and then I'll give you time to get all the codes and put in your comments um, and then I'll, pr I'll basically put it yeah I'll put the video up probably 10 a.m. on Thursday and then the stream will be 10 a.m. Friday so you have 24 hours so if you don't get on that's yeah, that's up to you um, just make sure you do get on and put all the codes in there that way when the uh, giveaway happens on Friday you will have your basically basically everything you need so anyways Let's get into the video. I'm getting attacked in the background. I was doing the, uh, what's called a thousand, I think it was the 2000 IQ trap actually for that one. I've uh, got a couple hits on that one. We will be showcasing some rallies as well today. I, I did do uh, a couple rallies. One was in Dragon Arena, one was outside of Dragon Arena. I kind of messed up on the one outside of Dragon Arena. I was kicking myself for that one, but you'll see that later on in the video. And again, don't miss all the codes today. Uh, there will be a video tomorrow, that's Tuesday, uh, Wednesday and then Thursday will be the last one and then streams Friday. Keep that in mind if you guys are a little confused and again if you guys do want to see some more of the uh, vacation clips let me know in the comments down below and I'll just put a couple of them in the videos just so you can see them. They're kind of they're kind of amazing some of the clips so anyways <laughs> let's get into this. I am doing the yeah 2000 IQ trap there is a titan next to me 118 castle star titan so I was a little bit uh, worried about this one just because I haven't really tested uh, the leader this trapping on this account yet code 16 solo attacks with the current comp so well I was like I'll see how this goes see if I get totally destroyed or not because obviously I tested a bunch with my other comp the uh, rain trap comp uh, that worked totally fine. I could take leaderless hits all day on that one. This one I wasn't 100% sure. This is more of a rally trap setup, but not very much tier 4. Because I only have about 450k of each tier 4, where the rally trap had a lot more. And unfortunately, it didn't go in, go in for the soul there, so I didn't get to test it. But this was during Dragon Arena, so my guild was going doing Dragon Arena. We're against FSX. Uh, it looks like uh, this guy's going to be rallying me. He's got seven, or 14 castle stars, so might be a decent lead. So I'm going to test out and see how well I do. I don't think it's a full rally. I do have my war gear on, my nice free-to-play gear. Again, this is a 100% free-to-play account. I do have the first purchase bonus is still available but keep in mind this account is four years old so it's a free to play account but four years into free to play so there's quite a bit of jewels on the account gear still sucks but jewels are pretty easy to get after four years just trust me um anyway so it is a uh, rally or what's called rain run uh, sorry cav rally in here i'm just gonna switch to the cav foul uh, or not right range phalanx um the rally has hit me it does not look like it hit walk back it was only 1.6 million let's see uh, not much damage. These are only 300k, and I think they might have the forts. I'm not 100% sure at this point, but uh, we are still fighting. Oh, we're losing quite badly, so they must have the, they must have the uh, extra attack boost too. So unfortunately, I don't think we have the attack boost. But uh, let's see here, FX FSX here. 
Um, it looks like someone else is going in, and this guy's a much better rally lead, so I'm probably going to burn on the next rally. They did do some solos here. Actually, this guy did as much as the as the uh, rally did. Let's see what he sent. Uh, he sent infantry into my cab, did quite a bit of damage. It's Mega Man X there. Uh, does have double pack five familiars and all that. Uh, that one did even more damage, 576. That was range into my range, so... Um, yeah, so those that, that extra 300% boost does go, do quite a bit of damage. Uh, you can obviously see there. I am down a little bit of troops just because, um, just because how the uh, thing was going, and obviously we're do doing dragery, and so I lose troops when I join rallies and stuff like that. But it looks like uh, MJ MJP is going to be the rally lead. He is much stronger. I'm probably 100% going to burn. I do not have enough troops to trap someone like this in a rally, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Plus, he probably has about a 300% attack boost, so keep that in mind. He has a massive attack boost because this is Dragon Arena, and they do have all the Ancient Remains, so um, yeah, we're kind of out of luck on that one. So <laughs> I am also down to 190 mil at this point. Yeah, you can see his gear is quite, or much, quite a, quite a bit better. Sorry. Uh, he has 1.6 billion might. Uh, I do have quite good jewels in my free play gear, but it's not quite enough. I am around 400% mix with this gear, a little bit higher in range. I'm just going to pour away uh, right as a captain. So I was trying to catch the guy um, in his uh, speed up gear. It might have worked there because I didn't take crazy amount of damage. He, it was actually infantry into infantry. He did about 2 million damage. I did not cap him. Uh, he still had a little bit of tier 5 and his siege there. I'm um, sorry I had to burn there. Um, anyways, um, yeah, tier 5 and his siege there, so he walked back with a little bit of troops, but um, I think he might have actually been in some infantry gear. I was trying to pull it away because I knew I would have been able to take it if he was in his gear, and you could see he might have actually gone in his gear, or he might have switched it after I poured it. I'm not 100% sure, but I tried to do the dirty port. He walked back with 239k, but actually he didn't do too badly for uh, how strong he was and what I actually have on this account right now, especially um, at whatever my might was at that point. So anyways, we're going to switch up into some more uh, solo trapping here. This guy's going in for the uh, self gangbang. I think my leader must have just came back at this point, so... He's going in to try and get the leader here. Uh, he's 2.1 billion might. Um, he, I guess he uh, decided to go in for a couple solo attacks before scouting me. Um, obviously, it did, did not work out too well for him. I uh, got a couple easy hits on there. Uh, yeah, there was 10 million on that one. Oh, sorry. Sorry, he sent 300k on both of them. Did about code 17 URA. 10k damage, 16k damage, or yeah, 16k damage on both. It was tier 4, tier 2, so all he lost was tier 2, so wasn't the biggest loss for him. Uh, but obviously, I didn't lose any troops, and I got a bunch of free kills on that one. Oh, by the way, the mini trap, I got to do a little bit of KVK. Unfortunately, like I said, I was away, so I only had about an hour or something to do KVK. Um, he's going in for another attack here. It looks like a bigger attack. Looks like he popped a boost here went 375k uh didn't heal so he lost 321,000. so a lot of that was tier 4 uh didn't shelter his tier 4 any i mean the the tier 2 wasn't really working since he uh didn't uh heal so he lost 221k tier 4 on that one didn't really do much damage to me again on that because he's not sending his leader so again my mini trap in kvk i was i wanted to tell you guys i did actually go and uh, do some mini trapping uh, actually got to see how well i could do where it was and it's pretty much where i thought it was uh under 800 percent i can cap pretty easily I need to stay away from people over 800%, especially if they double pack 5 familiars. Uh, that's just because I have less infirmaries and less HP and defense, so I do take more damage than a C25 trap. I realize that, but capping is not a problem. So I did cap uh, someone who is quite big in KVK, and I'll actually show that video probably later this week. So make sure you stay tuned for that video. That's going to be pretty awesome. Uh, tomorrow's video is going to be uh, full mythic rally trapping, by the way. Probably post the mini trap. Uh, KVK on Wednesday, so keep an eye out for that. So let's move on to the next clip. Again, uh, 1,000 IQ trap again, or 2,000 IQ trap, sorry. Uh, if someone burned my alt, leader's walking back. If you guys don't realize what these traps are, um, and you're not here for a long time, I do this trap a lot, and it works quite well. It, it kind of works all the time. <laughs> so um, I found this trap probably like two years ago, and I've been doing it ever since. I've obviously modified it over the years, so it's a little more efficient, and it works much better, but it just, it keeps working. Like, I've got... 
what is it, like 400 and something million kills on this account alone, and then my other account, I've got 350 million kills, and then another account, I have almost 400 million kills on that one too, so, um, it, it, get, it just gets you kills, like, people just keep hitting you. Um, I'm not sure if this guy is actually uh, falling for the trap, he saw my leader came back, or he just randomly poured next to me and just started attacking me, because it looks like he's kind of testing my front line here, um, and then he'll go in for an actual attack after this. Um, and then he sets a rally on me, and this is the rally that I mess up on, by the way. So, you'll get to see me mess up on a rally today. Um, and you, yeah. I mean, to be fair, I mess up quite a bit. <laughs> it's just how it is. Like, I mean, if they catch you off guard with carpet, sometimes you mess up, or sometimes your phone's lagging, and it's just like, um, it's just, it's not always perfect, but I try to do as well as I possibly can, but obviously, you get to, you do mess up, you are human, so. Um, eventually, if you're doing a bunch of trapping, you mess up eventually. So, anyways, he went in for another attack here. It was tier 4, tier 2. Um, he didn't do very much damage because I was countering him. So, I'm not sure if he was testing my frontline or not, but he does end up st setting a rally after this attack. So, uh, right after this, he has already set the rally here. Um, this guy, uh, I was looking at him, I was like, huh, he does I hope that's his fake here. And if it is his fake here, I want to try out a rally. So, now I'm going to try out the rally. See how it goes. Uh, we'll take a look at the report here. Tier 4, Tier 2 on that one. He did about 5k damage. Again, it was leaderless. So he's not going to do much to me. Um, this account is kind of set up like a rally trap. Just doesn't have enough Tier 4 to be actually a rally trap. So I'm kind of in between rally trapping and solo trapping. Um, you probably saw my other video where I code 18 solo trap boosted up the 650k of each tier 4 and then took a double rally on this account and I actually ate both of those so uh, 450k tier 4 is not enough to take rallies really uh, 650k is enough if you get rains because you have like uh, was that almost a million of each tier 4 at that point so you are technically a rally trap and that puts me around 220 mil might uh, with that comp so three mil of each tier four or tier two uh 650k of each tier four and then you can take rallies from smaller guys again you don't want to be taking titan rallies or anything like that <laughs> especially with my gear i do have 400 mix if you're going to be taking that you probably want closer to like uh 500 mix maybe the uh counter familiar and the counter hero or something like that then again you're a pay to play player at that point but for free to play this is kind of what you can do again you can trap anyone pretty much leaderless uh solo trapping with this comp i have right now uh rallies you can take technically smaller guys and i was going to take this guy but i really think i mess up on this so just just keep an eye on this see if i actually do get my gear switch on in time or not i was not a percent sure if i did uh, i do get the counter off I am in uh, range, so I'm going to switch to infantry. I'm just waiting until the last second so they don't cancel, but I kind of waited a little bit too long here. So I think <laughs> I think the rally literally hit like a second before I did that. I was like, ah, no, I, I switched too late. I didn't pop an attack boost either because uh, I didn't want them to get my comp because I thought I was going to eat this rally, honestly. I was like, I was going to port away. I was like, ah, whatever. They only did like 500k. I did, I did counter them, so they weren't doing a crazy amount of damage. I don't think the guy had really good... Um, let's call it attack or anything, and that's why I was taking the rally in the first place. But unfor unfortunately, like I said, I uh, might have missed my gear switch and took that in my construction gear. Um, there's a good chance that didn't happen, but um, looking at the damage, maybe it wasn't because only did a million damage. But uh, he did get walk back, so I was, I was like, God, God damn it! <laughs> so, anyways, someone else who was a proper rally lead set a rally on me after that, so I was like. I'm not going to take that one, but yeah, I was so hoping to uh, actually cap that rally. Didn't work, it's fine. All those troops go in the Sanctuary. I had Sanctuary space, so it's fine. Like, uh, yeah, like you can see, I can actually pull a lot of them out because uh, I technically have Tier uh, 3 in there on purpose. Uh, that way I can actually pull some troops out when I need to because Tier 3 give you a bunch more of those uh, resurrection points than Tier 2. So you can actually just keep some Tier 3 in your Sanctuary or Tier 4 in your Sanctuary and it'll actually give you instant heals out of your Sanctuary if you ever get Tier 2 in there. So keep that in mind, that's something I do a lot. I'll keep Tier 3 or Tier 4 in my Sanctuary only like a couple hundred K because a couple hundred K tier four in there is like 800 K tier two. So you could basically fill your sanctuary and pull them out instantly. Uh, just having 200 K uh, tier four in there to have those points saved up. So keep that in mind. That's actually a little trick you guys can do and actually have so if you get gang banged and you want to get some more troops out of your sanctuary, you can actually pull those out like instantly if you keep like 200 K or 300 or 200 K tier three or, or tier four in there 
keep that in mind. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video today, hope you guys learned something. Hope you guys learned not to uh, switch your gear after the rally hits you. Um, so if you guys enjoyed this, uh, hit the thumbs up and I will see you guys uh, tomorrow, probably in my uh, what's called rally trapping video. And you can see me mess up again on that one. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll see you guys in the next one.